Hello and welcome back to the channel once again. The name is Google Boy. Here in today's tutorial, we do have the Samsung Galaxy right over here being stuck on Google account verification after factory setting our device. So, in order to remove Google account verification on all your Samsung devices, you need to follow along with this tutorial as in the end of this tutorial you are going to, you will be able to remove google account verification on your device it doesn't matter which model so without wasting much time and effort we need to make sure that we have google account on our device then after confirming we have google account verification on our device we need to use our browser either you use your smartphone or your computer to access the web browser so on our web browser, we need to visit this website, which is smartunlock.org, which I'll leave the link in this video description for you guys to visit. So first things first, if you do not have an account, make sure to create an account and then log in. So here I do have an account already, which I'm going to log in. Once once you do log in to your Smart Unlock um, website, make sure to um, move into the IMEI service. So under the IMEI service, click on IMEI service and you will see a bunch of services that Smart Unlock do offer. So here we are searching for Samsung FRP, so just type in Samsung FRP or just type in Samsung and hit on search. This is going to bring all the results from Samsung services that Smart Unlock do have. So we are going in for the Samsung FRP worldwide KG and Wi-Fi device supported. So we are going in for this. Click on it. And um, we need to use our IMEI as this method require um our IMEI to unlock our device. So in order to know your IMEI, move into emergency dial star i 6 hash and you are going to see your IMEI. If you have double IMEI, make sure to use the first IMEI. Or if you do have one IMEI, just use the first IMEI. And the IMEI should contain 15 digit. So after pasting in your IMEI in the IMEI box, click on submit order. And wait for the order to be successful. So um, we've placed the order successfully. So we need to move into our order history in order to track our order status. So here on order history. And now here, let's go to see our order. So we ordered for Samsung FRP. Here we have it, it unattended. So um, let's wait for a while and refresh our browser and see if we have successful um, order being done. So let's refresh. and. We now have our order been pending so we need to wait as the order takes 1 to 15 minutes to get our device being done successfully so let's wait and refresh our browser again within some minutes and now we have a successful order saying, saying our um, IMEA has been registered successfully so now that we have our device being registered successfully let's switch back to our smartphone so here on our device we need to set up our device by connecting our device to a wi-fi network once we've done that connecting our device to a wi-fi network click on next and you will see checking for update and if you have been prompted with this google account um verification again or you have been prompted with the, with the enter previous pin then um all you have to do is to um reboot your device so here i'm going to reboot my device real quick and then after rebooting i'm going to disconnect from the um wi-fi network and reconnect to your wi-fi network now that we have our device been erased um rebooted we can now um connect to a wi-fi network if you have already been connected disconnect from the wi-fi network then reconnect to the wi-fi network again and also if you are enjoying my tutorials make sure to subscribe to the channel if you are new and also give a like to this video if you really enjoy my tutorials so here after connecting to a wi-fi network click on next and wait for it to check for update and after checking out for update it's going to switch to um checking for enrollment details so just wait and do not touch your device until it says restart your device so when you see restart your device here on restart now and wait for your device to restart 
so now we have our device been restart and now we can start up uh, or set up our device as usual and we finally remove the google account verification on our device so set up your device and you can see checking for enrollment details just wait and you can see click next to finish setting up our device so click on next agree to the terms of service wait for the enroll enrollment to finish and now we have our device successfully been activated or we've successfully removed the glutton verification on our device it's also known as the frp log so we've successfully removed the google account verification and now move into settings scroll down to you see about phone here on it and now wait for the enrollment to uh, remove the um config on our device so we've successfully uninstalled the config so we can move back to these settings scroll down to some about phones and you can see that we have the samsung galaxy x20 5g so this method will works on all samsung galaxy devices so you do not need to know your model all you need to do is to follow along with this tutorial know your imea number and submit it into smart unlock website so that's it for today's tutorial thanks for watching make sure to subscribe the name is good boy peace out